Ever wondered about the existence of reptilians? You're not alone. These enigmatic beings have been the subject of fascination, fear, and controversy for decades, if not centuries. From ancient mythologies to modern conspiracy theories, the reptilian narrative has woven itself into the fabric of our collective imagination. So, are you intrigued yet? Don't forget to subscribe and stay updated as we dive into this cryptic world. Ready to unlock the enigma? Here are seven fascinating facts about reptilians. Reptilian beings are not a new concept. In fact, they have a rich and storied history in various ancient mythologies and cultures. Picture this. Thousands of years ago, civilizations across the globe were spinning tales of serpent-like entities. The Mesopotamians revered their serpent gods, while in the heart of Mesoamerica, the feathered serpent deity Quetzalcoatl was a central figure in the lore. From the Nile to the Ganges and the Tigris to the Yangtze, the theme of reptilian entities consistently slithers its way into ancient narratives. These tales, while varied in their details, all share a common thread. The presence of powerful, intelligent, and often revered reptilian beings. It's fascinating, isn't it? The depiction of these entities across different time periods and geographies has sparked a world of speculations. Could these ancient cultures have been in contact with the same reptilian species? Were these tales simply a product of vivid imaginations? Or were they based on real encounters? Could these ancient serpent gods be our first accounts of reptilian beings? These questions remain unanswered, but they certainly add a layer of intrigue to our understanding of ancient cultures and their beliefs. And as we peel back the layers of history, we might just uncover more connections to these enigmatic reptilian entities. So, hold on to your scales, we're just getting started. Are reptilians from another planet, or even another dimension? A question that has fueled many late-night discussions and internet debates. The idea is not as far-fetched as it might initially seem, especially if you dive into the depths of conspiracy theories. The most pervasive of these theories suggests that reptilians aren't merely creatures of earthly folklore, but beings of extraterrestrial origin. Consider this. Imagine a species evolved on a distant planet, mastering the art of interstellar travel and reaching Earth. Some theorists propose these beings have been here for thousands of years, infiltrating our societies, taking on human form, and manipulating the course of our history from within. It's a narrative that might seem straight out of a science fiction novel, and yet, it's one that has resonated with many. These theories go even further, suggesting that these reptilians aren't just from another planet, but from another dimension entirely. A plane of existence separate from our own, from which these beings can influence our world in ways we can't even comprehend. The idea of reptilian overlords, hidden in plain sight, pulling the strings behind the scenes, has gained traction in certain circles. It's a concept that incites intrigue, skepticism, and sometimes fear. But it's these very reactions that keep the flame of curiosity alive. Imagine alien reptilians living amongst us, pulling the strings behind the scenes. It's a thought that's as fascinating as it is unnerving. And it's this enigma that continues to fuel the enduring allure of the reptilian conspiracy. What if reptilians could change their form at will? Imagine for a moment, beings with the ability to seamlessly blend into the crowd, taking on any guise they choose. This is a central thread in the tapestry of reptilian lore. Woven into the fabric of numerous conspiracy theories and science fiction narratives is the notion of reptilian shape-shifting. These beings are said to possess the astounding ability to morph into human form, allowing them to move undetected among us. This skill, if real, would provide them with the perfect camouflage, enabling them to infiltrate societies, influence events, and perhaps even control the world from the shadows. The idea of shapeshifters is not new. It's a concept that has appeared in folklore and mythology across cultures and throughout history. But the thought of reptilian entities employing this tactic to blend among us, well, that certainly adds a layer of mystery, doesn't it? What if world leaders aren't what they seem? Conspiracy theories have emerged suggesting that reptilians could be the puppet masters of our world, pulling the strings behind the scenes. These theories propose that reptilians wield their influence over human society by taking control of powerful individuals, from politicians to business moguls. Picture this. World leaders, the ones we trust to guide our nations, are actually reptilian-human hybrids. Their positions of power and influence are strategically used to shape global events according to their reptilian agenda. 
This isn't just about one country or one leader. We're talking about a global network of power and manipulation. From parliaments to palaces, from Wall Street to the World Bank, these theories suggest that reptilians could be controlling the world's most influential institutions. Quite a controversial theory, isn't it? Ever notice the serpent motif in your favorite movies or books? It's no accident. Reptilian symbolism abounds in our popular culture, subtly weaving its way into our collective psyche. The serpent, often associated with wisdom or malevolence, is a powerful symbol that resonates across different genres and mediums. Let's consider the world of cinema. From the cunning basilisk in Harry Potter to the deceptive Nagini, reptilian characters often serve as powerful antagonists or mysterious entities. They embody fear, treachery, or hidden knowledge, captivating audiences with their enigmatic charm. Moving on to literature, countless authors have employed the reptilian motif to convey complex themes. Whether it's the cunning serpent in the Garden of Eden or the dragon Smaug in The Hobbit, these characters are not merely villains. They symbolize deeper truths and existential dilemmas, reflecting our human fears and ambitions. The music industry isn't immune to this trend either. Many album covers, song lyrics, and music videos incorporate serpent symbolism, often to signify transformation, danger, or hidden wisdom. In the realm of TV shows, reptilian entities often play pivotal roles. They're shrouded in mystery, commanding our attention with their otherworldly presence and inscrutable motives. Reptilian symbolism in popular culture is a testament to how these beings have captured our collective imagination. They embody our deepest fears and desires, serving as a mirror to our complex human nature. But could the belief in reptilians be a reflection of our deepest fears and anxieties? That's a question some psychologists are asking. They propose that the reptilian narrative might be more about our inner psyche than about snake-skinned extraterrestrials. Let's delve a little deeper. Humans have an innate tendency to personify their fears, anxieties, and societal struggles. By attributing these complex emotions to a tangible, albeit mythical, entity, we attempt to make sense of our world. This process of externalizing our fears can be therapeutic and empowering, allowing us to confront and overcome them. The reptilian narrative, with its tales of shape-shifting beings infiltrating our societies, mirrors our concerns about trust, power, and influence. Who can we trust? Who holds the power? Are we being manipulated by unseen forces? These questions echo our collective anxieties about the world we live in. Psychologists also point out the significance of the reptile in our subconscious mind. Reptiles, particularly snakes, have been symbols of fear and fascination throughout human history. Psychologically, they represent our primal fears and instincts. The reptilian narrative might be amplifying these deep-seated emotions serving as a mirror to our collective psyche. So, while the existence of reptilian beings might be debatable, the psychological implications of the narrative are undeniably profound. Perhaps the reptilian narrative is not just about the beings, but also about us. Yet, skeptics argue that reptilian theories lack concrete evidence. The mainstream scientific community, for the most part, dismisses the idea of reptilian beings as mere flights of fancy. They point out that the evidence put forth by believers often relies on anecdotal accounts, personal testimonies, and interpretations of ancient texts and symbols. Critics argue that these are not enough to establish the existence of an advanced reptilian race living among us. Moreover, skeptics also highlight the lack of physical proof. Despite countless claims of sightings and encounters, there's a conspicuous absence of tangible, scientific evidence such as DNA samples or clear, unambiguous photographs. They argue that, without such evidence, the reptilian theory remains firmly in the realm of speculation. However, despite the skepticism and debunking attempts, the belief in reptilians endures. It seems that for every debunking attempt, a new theory or interpretation springs up to keep the mystery alive. The debate continues, adding to the enduring mystery of reptilians. So, that's our roundup of seven intriguing facts about reptilians. We've journeyed from ancient mythology to extraterrestrial conspiracies, touched on their alleged shape-shifting abilities, pondered their supposed influence on world leaders, and even delved into the psychological explanations behind these fascinating theories. Regardless of where you stand on the spectrum of belief, the enigma of reptilians continues to captivate us all. Whether you find these tales compelling or dismiss them as fantasy, stay curious everyone.